For our All About Me week, we've been talking about how we're each special in our own way and how God made us each special. This book is called There's Only One You. It's written by Katherine Keeling and Deborah Hembrook and illustrated by Rosie Butcher. There's Only One You. In all the world, this much is true. You're somebody special. There's only one you. Your knees might feel knobby. Your ears might stick out. Are you tall? Are you short? Are you thin? Are you stout? You might be outgoing or maybe you're meek. Wherever it's awesome being unique. Do your feelings spill out? Do they lay low and hide? You might cry when you're sad or keep tears inside. Do you smile just a bit or laugh loud with a shriek? You're different. It's awesome being unique. Your color of skin is a beautiful sight. Light as the moon or dark as the night. Your skin is so perfect from toes to your cheeks. It's truly splendiferous being unique. Your hair might be curly or a long, thick cascade, worn short in a buzz cut or tied in a braid. Your hair might be poofy or straight, smooth, and sleek. It's wild, it's wonderful being unique. When there's something to say, do you talk with your hands? Do you speak with an accent from faraway lands? Some voices are booming and some just a squeak. Your way is the best way of being unique. Can you sing? Do you dance? Sports and drawing are fun. Good at spelling or math? Do you like more than one? Is building for you or gymnastic techniques? It's great to celebrate being unique. You might have cool glasses that help you to see. A wheelchair or walker gives mobility. A hearing aid helps you to hear people speak. Listen, it's glorious being unique. Friends come in bunches or groups of a few, but maybe just one friend is perfect for you. Do you play with your friends once a day, once a week? It's fun, it's fabulous being unique. When it's time to dig in and learn something new, there's more than one way of seeing it through. You can work slow and steady or in a fast streak. Your brain grows in your way, being unique. Families are families, but soon you will find that each can be different, a best for them kind. You're part of a family, you make it complete. Hooray for the one that's yours, it's unique. In all the world over, this much is true. You're special, unique. There's just one of you. The end. Remember, God made you special no matter what you look like or what you like. You're special to God and to your family.